Now, it's just over a week until the controversial badger cull starts in parts of Gloucestershire. The government's hoping that by reducing the number of badgers, there'll be a drop in the cases of bovine TB on farms. Well, tonight, a group against the cull are meeting, and our environment correspondent, David Gregory Kumar, is there. So what are they planning to do, David? Well, Nick, this is a meeting that's going to kick off uh, at 7 o'clock. It's a meeting of GABS, that's Gloucestershire Against Badger Shooting. That was a group formed in uh, 2012 to try and stop the cull going ahead. But as you said, it looks like it may well start sometime, for, well, anytime from the 1st of next month. And with me to explain more about the meeting tonight is Drew Patton from GABS. I mean, Drew, what are you talking about tonight? Uh, tonight we're talking about the Wounded Badger Patrol. Uh, effectively what we're going to do is go to public footpaths, uh, margins of roads and things and look for wounded badgers and offer them first aid and any help that we can. Now farmers say they need to cull badgers because they spread TB. Mm -hmm. uh, we see, I mean there are uh, in just a few miles down the road in Wales they're vaccinating their badgers. Um, if, they, if they want to put a trial here then trial vaccination. There's a lot of more badgers been vaccinated in Gloucestershire than any other county. Um, so the cull could start any time for the first of next month. I mean, you've really lost this one. What else can you do now? Uh, we're hoping for an opposition day debate in the Houses of Parliament, uh, when they then have to take it back to Parliament uh, to hear a full debate on it. Uh, we're still writing to the councils. Uh, recently, Gloucestershire Council passed an amendment against the cull. Uh, so we, there are avenues open. And how much feeling is there? I mean, how many people do you think you might get at tonight's meeting? Uh, well, we're hoping, it, it's been arranged at quite short notice, but we're hoping for a good turnout. Um, we've had uh, about three, four hundred offers of support for this. Uh, not necessarily this meeting, but for the Wounded Badger Patrol itself. So, thank, thank, well, we'll see what happens, because we're going to be staying here tonight and going out on the first Wounded Badger Patrol, and we'll have an update in tonight's programme at 10 o'clock. Back to you. David, thank you.